Good morning, everyone. It is Tuesday, March 31st, and our second day of the second week of virtual learning. So I start off again with the class website only because I want to really, 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 really make sure that you guys are understanding that everything that you guys need is going to be on here and on Google Classroom as well. So what I want you guys to go ahead and see is you're gonna start off at the home page, just like I told you yes, just like I showed you yesterday. Um, here I'm leaving the I ready stuff up so that you guys can see. In the case that you haven't done it yet, I haven't checked yet who is missing it or who um, has completed it. So if you didn't do it, you still have a couple of days for that. I am going to be removing this um, in a couple of days. So make sure that if you didn't do it, that you completed your I ready. So we're gonna go ahead and start with um, our virtual learning. So you have my tab here, right? And then you have Miss Science's tab here. So you're gonna go through by the dates. So if yesterday was Monday, today we're going down to Tuesday. So when you click on Tuesday, it's going to take you directly to your agenda for today. So for today, this is what you guys are going to be doing. Do not forget to submit your attendance. If you do not submit your attendance, you are going to be marked absent, even if you are completing the work. Okay, that is already set up for you on Google Classroom. So just go in there under the attendance topic and you can go ahead and um, click it and say that you're present. Um, then you're going to obviously watch today's video. This should not take you guys more than about five minutes. Um, again, a little bit more, a little bit less. The little time here, that is what it should take you to go ahead and complete each of the assignments. Your second um, item on the agenda today is going to be your book of knowledge. That's the article a day. So uh, once you go ahead and log in to ReadWorks, and you can click here, and it's going to take you directly to ReadWorks. Okay, just like this, you're going to go to student login and you're going to go ahead and log in with Google, which you guys were doing that during the first week of virtual training, uh, virtual learning. So there shouldn't be any issues with that. And then you're going to go, it should already be set up for you. And the set that you guys were assigned was health problems and treatments. Do the book of knowledge. Don't do the one that just says got allergies because that is an assignment that you are going to be doing uh, later this week. So what you guys are doing is under the set titled health problems and treatments, you're gonna read that article got, um, got allergies and then you're gonna answer the question, how can problems be solved? So you're gonna look for the problem in the text and how was it solved? And then that is what you're gonna answer in the book of knowledge box. So when you guys log in, they go ahead and put in book of knowledge. That is how you are, that is the question that you are going to go ahead and answer. This should take you no more than 15 minutes. That includes reading the article and then answering that question. Again, some of you may take a little bit longer, some of you may take a little bit less time, but it should be about the 15 minutes. Okay, the third item on your agenda. It's a vocabulary practice worksheet. This was a Google slide that was assigned to you guys already on Google Classroom. You are able to type directly on the worksheet that's there for you. So you're, I gave you guys about 15 minutes to complete that. That's very straightforward. It's on your Google Classroom. Just don't forget to submit. Okay, uh, the fourth item on your agenda today is to watch the problem and solution teacher presentation. I know that you guys watched one yesterday. This is kind of the same, but it's a little bit different. So make sure that you guys are, going, are watching that. It's just to give you an idea of problem and solution text structure using the Stephanie Kolick story. This should not take you longer than 15 minutes. It's a very short video, just to give you guys an idea. Okay, so about 15 minutes. Then you have a problem and solution practice for unit five, week three. Um, that is once again assigned on Google Classroom for you. And um, it's you're gonna it's kind of like the practice book. You're gonna read those two stories and you're you're gonna read the one story, it's two pages, and then you're gonna answer the five questions that belong to it. And it's multiple choice. Don't forget to submit, because if not, I will get your responses. And then the last item on your agenda is going to be to complete the intro paragraph. A lot of you are not 
doing the essay. I have some of you that went ahead and submitted those to me either before we went on spring break or during spring break. If that's what you did, you do not have to do an essay. But if you're still pending, you need to go ahead and send me and start um, completing your essay. It is due on Friday and it is going to be for a grade. So today you should be completing your introduction. I saw quite a few of you that had not even completed your planning. So each part of the essay is going to be graded. So today you are going to go ahead and complete your introduction paragraph and you can go ahead and put that on a Google document and then just go ahead and share it with me so that I can look it over and if I need to fix anything, we can go ahead and fix anything, okay? Once you're done with that, and that should be about 15 to 30 minutes, okay? Remember that your uh, intro paragraph should only be anywhere between four to five sentences. No more than that. It's very short, sweet, and to the point. You are just introducing, okay? Once you're done with my class, and if you guys notice, there really isn't too much on here. It shouldn't take you too, too long to finish your assignments today. Then you can go ahead and move on to Ms. Science's class and then just complete anything that she has um, for you guys for today. And then if you guys want to know your homework, you guys can go up here. And if you notice, your homework is simply yesterday was I ready and today it's Maya. Do about 30 minutes or so. Your vocabulary words are here so that you have them. There is no excuse for you guys not doing well on your vocabulary practices. And your vocabulary quiz is going to be on Tuesday, on Thursday, so please make sure that you guys are studying. Okay, and that would pretty much be it. There really isn't anything else um, that I see you guys need to um, go ahead and do today. So I hope you guys have a great Tuesday and happy virtual learning. Just like always, remember, I'll be on Hangouts. And if you have any questions, just let me know. Don't forget to submit attendance. Don't forget to submit your assignments. Love you all. Miss you guys. And have a great Tuesday.